then let us be off. Let us be off. Hello, folks. This I is Vagrant. Oh. To our Welcome back to a Dragon's Dogma we Two. For half village, as I recall. It is not far from here. Garen likes to. Uh, she likes to lead me around. And fuck up barrels. All right, hi, yeah, well, oh no, I can't swear in the first couple of minutes. Uh, right, yeah, so we are currently on a monster culling mission and we're heading down to this village over here to assist in more monster culling, basically. There are useful ingredients to be gathered here, I'll wager. We could pick some now and use them when the need arrives. <laughs> I'm trying to figure out which way I'm going. I'm going right, aren't I? Have I gone right? I don't know. I think it's this way. Uh, right, yeah, anyway, so we're currently monster culling. We're a little bit beaten up. Last mission took it out of me a little bit. Am I going the right way? Yeah. No, no. I need to be on this path up here, actually. Um, uh, we, we took a bit of a beating last time around. Things are a little bit a little bit rough, but we're okay. Yeah. Is your pack not overburdensome? Oh, you carry so much. I worry for your poor spy. I'm not. It certainly mm. isn't easy work, but I'm proud to be counted upon. Oh, she was talking to Balthasar. Balthasar, you're a Chad. You're a hero. And I love you. I'm going to get Balthasar a carry ring as well, I think, at some point when I can afford it. They're pretty pricey, though, so it's. <laughs> Wait for it. <laughs> Nobody has ever hated a crate as much. As this woman does. She just has a specific thing about You're well fond of blowing up, crates up. Oh, I've hit heavy as well. Yeah, we are. We're getting a little overstocked. Ooh, but that's a chest. I can I resist? I can I? We're going to finish this little bit and then we'll head back to town and clear out in a way. It's going to be okay. It's going to be okay. It's going to be fine. Maybe we can uh, do a little bit of combining. So that's going to make um, one of those. Oh, I kind of want to... Oh, you know what? Let's just do it. Let's see what we make. Uh, let's use that because we've got two of them. Oh, okay. So that makes the, the thing... So I don't want to use those, but we can use these. Got some quince, which is cool. Saves a little bit. I'm not using the cinnamon anymore, though. There we go. Just ticked back under average. Hello. Oh, you're just a dude. Just a furry dude. Hello. Here we go. This way. Oh, and we got. Oh, this is I've perfect. Every we've got a campsite, and we've got a we've got a merchant. Precisely the things I needed. So let's try to clear out some weight. So I've got these rangers' ties. They're really good, actually, but they don't fit me. So what is a boy to do? Uh, I keep selling all this. Boost your strength and magic. You know what, I just... It might be foolish. I'm not going to pretend otherwise, but I just, I don't like tinctures. I don't like temporary boosts. You know, it's, this has long been established about me that I really dislike temporary boosts. What is this? A smoke beacon that emits a scent enticing to harpies. When lit in certain locations, harpies within range will flock near. I mean, that does that is that particularly? I don't know. <laughs> this doesn't sound particularly useful, but I'm sure it is. Okay, and I'd like to clear. Yeah, let's get this gone for Balthazar. Lovely jubbly. Anything cool to sell? Oh, wakestone shards. Interesting. Hope to see you again ere long. You too, Marcelo. You're a good egg. No purchases to be made today, I see. I just hope the shopkeep understands. Yeah, I, I sold him things. Let's make camp. We've got another camping kit, so I think that's okay. We need some health back. Hello, gang. Leave the finding of equipment enhancing materials to me, master. I shall sniff them out and mark them on your map. I like you, Garan. Garan, you're a good egg. The private quarters of one arisen I served. Had many a visitor, and rarely the same one. Little bit of goss. <laughs> I appreciate it. Uh, examine skills. Yeah, we're definitely good. Skills is something we're going to have to go check. We should have. Yeah, look, look. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait, no, I just rested till nightfall. I was trying to click off the things. No. Can I rest? Oh, I've made a terrible mistake. Okay. 
I've made a terrible, terrible mistake. Journey by starlight shall make for a nice change of pace. Feeling rested, I trust? It's fine. It's fine. We're just doing this one little bit. <clears throat> and you know what? It'll help me spot the beetles easier. Let's pretend it was all on purpose. It's fine. Everything's fine. Um, we've got so many DCP. They're things we used to buy vocation skills. I just saw it. We've got tons of the bloody stuff. Way more than we had last time. So. I could look upon this sky for all eternity. Mm. If it wasn't for the crick in my neck. Keep gazing up while Oh, there it is. <laughs> I heard something loud. <laughs> What's going on over there in the corner? Try not to get hit. Lest all that vim go to waste. There is something... Is a tendency we might exploit. Right, I need to heal. There is something in the distance, I think. What is this? Is this an enemy? What is this? Like a spirit. Ah! No! <laughs> I was trying to prioritize! Help! Help, Kang! Help! No, it's stealing me away, guys! Like oh, it's Get him, gang! Get him! This thing has three health bars. Literally three health bars. Keep bashing it, guys. You know what? That could have gone right. I need to kill. I need to kill the spirit. I think. Jesus Christ. I don't think we should be fighting this thing. I am grateful to you. Let's go put this out there. <laughs> I'm not sure we should be fighting this thing. Whoa. I've not even gone through that first health bar yet, man. Save Balthazar! Save Balthazar! At least I'm getting some good damage in for once. First health bar down. Two to go. What I might do, actually, while I'm up here, if I can stay up here, is pop an item to replenish my stamina. And, uh, which I think I've got. Keep stabbing away. I know I think he's gone down. We'll go rescue him in a second. But I'm getting so much damage in that I don't want to squander the opportunity. I'm going to say this opportunity to rescue my boy. Come on, buddy. Lad. Ah. Stab it in the head! What's oh, a buff sauce? Oh no! Oh no! Oh, it was aware of my plans! Intense fight, innit? Bloody Nora. These things are tough. I've got this random little dude helping me out as well. Random pawn. I need to be climbed on during this bit. There we go. There we go. That's what we needed. Nearly there, folks. Final health bar, baby. Final health bar, baby. Oh. You 
Tell them to run. Oh no! Oh no! Get up! Get up, kid! Get up! Nice, Garen. I need to remember, I need um, a photo mode. <laughs> I need, need a pick. I'm not sure that's the... Oh no, that's not bad. I can shift the tool to the side. It's really hard to get photos off the thing you're... I'm gonna try to get on top of its back again, and I'm gonna take a little pick, if I can. That might look cool. That might look cool. Yeah, I mean, I'm kind of like at the completely wrong angle, but we're giving it a go. <laughs> I'm going to do the same again. This is the first time I've really used um, stamina items. We don't have that many of them, actually. And I don't really have any at all. <laughs> um, yeah, these. There we go. Not sure I'm on the best angle, but you know what? It's bloody working. Get out of there, Kitai. Kitai. Go get healing. There you go. Clever. My magics are at your disposal. Rip and tear until it's done. Uh oh. Ah, I tried to jump off in time. Get in the healing bubble for a minute. Oh, Kitai's on. I thought it was going to try and make a run for it there. Where's your Vim, nerd? Nearly there, gang. Nearly there. Come on. One more hit. One more hit. Whew. That was a tough old fight. Bloody Nora. A tough old fight. Look how much health I lost. <laughs> we just recovered our health entirely. I've got none left already. That was a, an epic battle, to say the least. It was a lot of fun. <laughs> I really enjoy it. Like I, I said in the last video, I'm going to you know, take a break for a little bit. Until the... Um... You stay away from my Balthazar. I was gonna, you know, take take a couple of days off and just kind of record on the day in order to make sure the game can upgrade a little bit. You know, patch some things out. I could I couldn't resist if I'm honest. <laughs> that didn't last long at all. I just said I'm enjoying myself too much. So it's it's literally the same day. It's about an hour later from when I did the last video because I just want to keep playing the game. As long as I stay out of the seas, it'll be fine. While in another world. I happened upon a treasure chest rather close by here. Perhaps I can show you the way? I knew I could see some. Ah! Using Go Command immediately after a pawn makes a suggestion. Prompt them to follow them through their idea. Pawns. Okay, cool. That sounds good. A flawless execution. Would that we might always be so in step, eh? Okay, so Garen is going to lead me to a treasure chest. So you, we mentioned this in like one of the initial videos, right? I said, what if you found something in another playthrough and then your people could tell you about it? Or the pawns could tell other people about it? Or their pawns could go back to... Um, if your pawns could go to... If, you're, if you could... Right, okay. <laughs> if you took a pawn from someone, right? You are mighty indeed, Arisen. <laughs> and then you found something in the wild, if they would then tell their master, inverted commas, about it when they got back. I mean, that is what just happened. Whether that's a scripted thing or not, I don't know, but it's pretty cool that it works at all. So Garen is going to lead us for a treasure chest that they found whilst in someone else's world. That's really nice. Harvey Village, Coastal Settlement. Ave Maria. Nearly.
Apart from having a little sit down for some reason. Oh, we've got a... Oh, I like these ones. Okay, that's a summon one. That could be useful still. Methinks there are rare materials to be found hereabouts. Oh, hello, well, beautiful. That's quite a discovery. They're my favourite materials in the entire... <laughs> like, if I could find nothing but those for ages, I'd be very happy. Whoa, wait, what? 2,950 gold? Incredible. I'm just going to check over here for a sec. It tends to be that if something's listed on the map, there tends to be like a... A little something something in the area. It seems you've somewhere else in mind you'd rather go. If you've no need of my guidance. Oh no, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm by sorry. By all means, lead the way. I'm sure there's a very good reason for this detour. We must respect <laughs> our master's wishes. Thank you, Balthazar. No, it's fine, let's go. We've more places to go, yes? Then let us be off. Wait, where are we in relation to I mean we're just going towards a mission anyway. I was hoping for an inn or something here. I say we start with the location nearest us. Twill save us a world of effort. Twill taunt it. Taunt it. Twill taunt it. You've come to a dangerous place. Scaly beasts make this their den. We've been dispatched to cull them. I feel like Dylan should have a double N. A small force ventured inside. Though I've seen neither hide nor hair of them since. Seems the battle is hard won. I'll not stop you if you wish to explore. But don't look for my aid if aught goes awry. Sorry, wouldn't you dispatch here to help? And you've decided. It was an eventful journey, <laughs> but not we made to? it here all right. For some reason. What the heck is that? Use of a fairy stone instantly trans. Okay, use of a fairy stone instantly transport you to the location of a port crystal. Port crystals are permanent fixtures of cities and towns. You may as well place your own port crystals at destinations of your choice. You may have up to ten port crystals placed at various times throughout the world. Once placed, it can be recovered if you move it elsewhere. Permanent ones must be interacted with at least once before they become available. Ah, so I should have clicked. I should have found the one in town. <clears throat> well, that means we can teleport here if we want. Now we only have. We do have a ferry stone, but I think we've got one. Oh, we've got two. We've got two. So we could ferry back to. No, we can't ferry back to town because I didn't click it. Fast travel is meant to be limited in this game, to say the least. You know, you're meant to explore the world and. It's, it kind of brings you into the world, I find. Yes, yes, of course. We were speaking of places elsewhere. Are you okay, hey, buddy? Tis beyond your ken. But this world of ours is not the real one. Uh huh. This world is a cycle. The dragon emerges, the dragon is slain, and just when we think we have found peace at last, the dragon appears once more. It's very Dark Souls, isn't it? It is endless. Endless and tiresome, wouldn't you say? You'll notice all the big RPGs. Yet, such is the lot of those who reside in a false world like ours. Love cycles. The real world is not nearly so stagnant. All manner of things occur there. It is a far more fearsome existence than ours, to be sure. Is there a way to travel to the real world, you ask? <laughs> Must I do all the thinking here? Ponder that yourself. It's just talking about me clicking. What I will say. Is that I believe oh my God! <laughs> will continue unbroken for as long as the dragon continues to be slain. You doubt your ears, but I speak truly. I have beheld the real world with my own eyes. Okay, good chat, there, buddy. Here you are, master. I hope you like it. I found it myself. That old man by the shore. What drives him so unbendingly out into open waters? He's something of an enigma, isn't he? Perhaps we will understand more in time. What was I talking about before he kept talking and I got very distracted by his continued talking? Um, oh, I don't remember. <laughs> the old man distracted me. It looks like there's a pathway. Is there a ca ah. Stormwind Cave. Caverns such as these that monsters thrive. What I wouldn't give for a map, particularly one that could tell us where all the treasure lies. Lies. Fine. There's a haze. Oh my eyes. Thurston. Anyone hear me? We need help. Mom away, Thurston. Mom away, buddy. Damn oh, these are these are tough ones. It feels like it. 
Where's my gang? I feel very lonely down here. I don't like fighting without my my lightning boon anymore. Especially because these guys are weak against them, aren't they? If a resident of this world dies, oh no, they died! The resident has the power to revive him using a wake stone. The bodies of the dead are not left to the mercies of the elements. Will in short order be taken to a Morgoth charnel house? Thurston! Well, I'm sad that Thurston's dead. But you know what? It's nice that there are real world consequences. Thurston died. I didn't get here in time. It was too slow to. I didn't defend him well, you know? So Thurston dies. That's just the way it is. He's just dead. <laughs> I don't have a wake stone for him, so he is now dead. Mind, I have time for a citizen in need. Sure. But we press on all the same. Apologies, Master, but I can't guide you there from our current location. We have yet more locations to attend to. I shall guide us to our nearest destination. I, I might meant to be down here. Oh, I'll you sorry, do. For Har Village, as I recall. It is not far from here. Garan, you, you're lovely, but shush. <laughs> Where do you think we just came from, girl? She's a chatterbox, isn't he? Isn't she? Whereas Katai, Katai doesn't say a bloody word. She really does not talk at all. Ooh, 300 gold. Why the strange of gold on a corpse? I don't know. <laughs> that seems like a problem for other people than myself. Something up here. Oh, I'm on my way, boy. Feast your eyes on this. Okay. God damn, I missed every hit. <laughs> Okay. Okay, let's get a little bit of a heal. Oh, am I the only one getting knocked about? Uh no, you're not. Oh. I will protect you. I'm really struggling here. I'm kinda of stuck in this corner. We really are we're gonna need uh, a big old rest after this. Expedition, it's been a bit of a disaster. There we go, Balfsar. There's my boy. That's what I needed. Maybe I need to upgrade my shield as well. It's the only thing I didn't upgrade. Oh, bloody Nora. It's done. Oh, we did it. Please say, you're not one of ours. Have you come to save us? Yeah, but what if you died, Hollis? I'm sorry. Forgive me. I cannot seem to walk of my own accord just now. Would you aid me in reaching the entrance? Sure. This way? I'll get that for you. Look at my health reduction. It's mad. Water is now invisible in this room. <laughs> no few times has an overconfident step to I just need the bodyguard theme tune to start playing now. Say, that's part and parcel <laughs> of the adventurer's trade. Come on, buddy. Let's get you out of here. I just got me right, I can't I can't throw him, <laughs> unfortunately. I have to release. Grumble grumble. And uh is that the bodyguard? I will always love you. Oh no. Right, I'm gonna put you down for a minute, buddy. Oh, hello, cheeky. Oh, well spotted. Nice. Most impressive. Such a thing escaped my master's notice entirely. Well, I'm much more intensive. It's not dead, is he? <laughs> is he okay? 
don't know what. I don't, I don't know what happened. I really worried that I killed him there. You have to do this bit on your own, okay, buddy? We shall have to crane our necks to spot our foes in a place like this. Keep your voice low, lest my heart leap from my throat. Gotta get this numpty out of here alive. Oh, it's daytime. Oh, thank God it's daytime. In there to save my fellow soldiers. Well now, I underestimated you, friend. I shall send word of your deeds to the captain. You've done well this day. I thank you. We'll see to the rest of this mess. You need not trouble yourself further. Good job, gang. My only concern is that in there, I saw a little... A little something. There's like another offshoot that I didn't take, but I think I think it's time to leave. Oh, so you can see there's a stone there, so I can port crystal there. Um, but if I go into Vernworth, I can't see it. So next time we go to Vernworth, we're gonna have to make sure we find the port crystal because I think being able to teleport back here is also gonna be a big deal. <clears throat> if absolutely need be. Oh, hello. Hold, sir. I'd rethink pressing onward if I were you. The village is crawling with sorry. Oh no. Forgive me. I didn't mean to startle you. I used to call this place home, you see. In times more peaceful. Hmm. You're the Arisen, are you? Well, that's something. We were hoping to reclaim our village. But it doesn't seem we'll have much luck. We fled when the dragon attacked some days past. Thinking we'd return once the baleful thing was gone. Easier said than done, clearly. In our absence, a bosk of Saurians have made our homes their own. What are we to do? The guards not like to send soldiers all the way out here. Ah, oh, but mayhap they needn't at all. You are the Arisen, I. Could we trouble you to aid us in our hour of need? Please, sir, do something, anything about the Saurians infesting our village. Sorry, mayhap I could. We need not shrink. Where the ice is numbing grip. Oh, the Rita ice. Extra damage a second from behind. Don't we have a report to make, Master? Did it, gang? Proud of me. Is the deed done, good Arisen? Oh, thank you, thank you. We shall all be able to return to our homes at last. I can hardly wait to bring these tidings to the other villagers. I dare say we'll have this place livable again ere long. I cannot thank you enough. Long will you be known as a friend to our village. If you happen to pass by, do come visit us, won't you? I should like for you to see this place as it was before the dragon's attack. For your sake, as well as ours, we'll do our utmost to see the village restored. With this, the peril has passed. Oh, cool. Still, perhaps we were to visit the village again anon. Just to be certain. Yeah, we'll come back in a few days and uh, so. see how things are. I just want to check this building at the end over here. Uh, da -da -da -da. And then we're heading back to the castle and recovering slightly because goddamn, it's been a journey. Ingredients are plentiful hereabouts. I say we collect as much as we can carry. Oh, that's a lot of oh, that's a lot of money in books right there. Is looting from <laughs> this burnt-out village desperately trying to reclaim itself? We have found a material. Is it the right thing to do? <laughs> different combinations of materials result in different creations. Creations. Look what I have is they don't heal me out of combat. Like I could do with a little heal right now. Sure. I mean, Garen is 
super near dead. I'm gonna heal Garen. I'm a good person, what can I say? You gonna heal? What if I... No, okay. I just click use, yeah. Don't know how that works. Maybe it doesn't work at all. Let's go home, shall we? I say home. To the capital, where I've lived for about five minutes. We've got a lot of stuff. Let me go empty this inventory out. Heal ourselves up a little bit. And go talk to the vocation people. Might you consider lightening your pack, Master? No. If you've anything edible, I'll gladly lessen your burden. <laughs> I'm sure you will, Balfasar. I'm sure you will. I'll be fine. I'll be fine. Don't you worry about me, my lovelies. Did I eat my little my little dude I found? I didn't. My little dude. I think we've had four of those so far, so that's what, 0.6 of a kilogram? It's not a huge amount. <laughs> I can pretend otherwise. Well, it is what it is. I've got a good feeling about this one. Oh, about what? Oh, combat. Garan, you okay? What, what are you doing? <laughs> now, what's the well, so what? What's the exclamation point here? There's, I mean, look. Sometimes I'm not sure, and sometimes oh, it's gone, isn't it? I think it was just the combat then. A little house over there. Let's check this out. A little ruin. And then we have quite an arduous journey back. Ah, eh, it's not that bad. Just there, and then we're going over there. Try to find that this time. We'll be fine, folks. We'll be fine. I'd wager there's ought to be found here. Or there is. How best to proceed. Ought there mayhaps tis. Oh, it's a dude. Most enemies in this game are animals, so I, I tend to assume humans are gonna be chill. But obviously, there's bandits and such. Alphazar, no! Everyone's okay. Everyone's a little bit on the edge, but everyone's okay. Oh, hello. You know what this reminded me of? I instinctively knew to jump over there because Elden Ring has so many ruins that were absolutely identical to that. I don't suppose begging for a Wait, he's, he's zombified. It's a zombie? He's straight up a zombie. What's going on? Look at him! He's a full-on walking dead style zombie! Aha! I need to be more down here. This is a bit aggressive, maybe. <laughs> ow, ow, ow. Wait, did I just die? I didn't realize my health was so low. Oh, I'm an idiot. My health was way lower than I realized. Right, the autosave tends to be okay in this game. Hopefully this isn't too far back. I can't believe I've died twice. I, I just didn't, I didn't notice my health. Obviously my max health is tidy at the moment. Oh man. When you take damage, not only...
Max Alpha Fusion. Oh, right. No, wait, what? No, I don't get that. Oh, no, I get that. I get that, yeah. While traveling beyond the rift, okay, at least we're back down here. But yeah, look at, I mean, look at my loss gauge. It's over half my health at this point. Okay, okay. This time, we're gonna be fine. We're gonna be fine. See, our fight is not yet done. We fight to arms. Very well, my master. Get off me! Get off! No! I'm getting zombied! I'm getting zombied! Getting zombied again! <laughs> Cheers! Keeping a very close eye on my health bar. Bloody Nora. Well, worth it. Never mind the items, so I've got another wake stone, which is great. It means I can come back to life. Um, but the main thing is the humongous amount of gold we found. The 3,500 gold in the corner. Over so soon? Why? We seem to have come through unscathed. Eh, I'm not so sure about that. This triumph will spur us into the next. The funny thing is, in that situation, would you want to use a wake stone? Isn't it better to just load an auto save? The purpose of wake stone for me is more. It's not about saving yourself. It should be more about saving. Um. To take a closer look. I've already explored the area, man. Should be about. Um. Okay. Okay, Garant. Yeah, I'm gonna follow you. I'm gonna follow you. But it should be about reviving companions more than yourself, I think. What are you guys up to? There are useful <laughs> ingredients to be gathered here, I'll wager. Oh, where? We could pick some now and use them when the need arises. There's nothing. Oh, is there? Alright, Gren wanted to take me to something, I think. Oh, she might have been taking me to that. I have no idea. Master, I'm not sure how much longer I can keep going without rest. I know, Katai, we're all tired. We to take a moment to catch our breath, if we can spare. Well, I mean, everyone's at half health, yeah. Katai's actually the only one who's doing okay. Everyone else is a bit of a disaster. I enjoy tackling fierce foes and prefer combat's thrills to gathering items. Oh, that's a level 14. That's a level 14 archer. I probably need him. I think I'm dropping... Katai doesn't have a specialization. Do I want to be the only melee character, though? Uh, I'm sorry, Katai. You were great. And I'll... I mean, I don't know why I send them off with a gift. I really don't, but I'm going to have a withered branch. There you go. At least I go, knowing I fought to the best of my ability. You were great, Katai. You were you were great. Ah, good. I see the Arisen's found someone to handle our busy work. Points are awarded badges as a mark of their accumulated knowledge and expertise. Can I just point out, you know when we played Dave the Diver, and every few episodes it feels like the game just throws another random mechanic at you? This game is the same. There are so many layers of mechanical depth. <clears throat> anyway, so pawns are awarded badges as mark of their accumulated knowledge and expertise, whether that be proficiency in combat or experience exploring. Pawns with badges are more helpful to the risen in word and in deed. <sighs> monster badges are awarded to pawns who have defeated a certain number of particular type of monsters. Such pawns are by then so experienced with the creature in question they know the best way to defeat it and will offer advice to the risen. See, this is an awesome mechanic. Field badges are awarded to ones who've camped a sufficient number of times in a particular region. When adventuring said region, they'll display their knowledge of the area by offering beneficial advice. That's cool. Uh, oh, I didn't see you there. Well, I suppose I was preoccupied with my thoughts. Thoughts of you, Arisen, naturally. Sounds a bit too much like Balthazar, though. 
What I really wanted was information on him. Well, let's see how you handle yourself, buddy. No sense letting the enemy gain the upper hand. The early Griffin gets the worm, as they say. I'm on my way. I'm on my way. Prop getting taken away by the wolf there. My thanks, sir. Zeltra. Here you are. It is a reward well earned. No worries. I could not help, could I? Fifteen hundred? Not bad. Not bad now. Am I going the right way? Follow this road. Yeah, just follow the road. Try to stay on the path. Like, well, we'll if something very interesting grabs my eye, I can I resist, but it's really about survival. I'm not even going to camp, I don't think. Destination if you continue in that direction, Master. But I suppose I can guide us there later. Karen, this is literally the right direction. Called some more pressing business. Fret not. I'm sure we'll come back to this eventually. What am I hearing? I don't like whatever it is. These bridges make me nervous, you know. <laughs> Sounds harpyish, maybe. Oh, why am I about to check something as well? He still has the camping kit. Do you just always have a camping kit? Okay. It says it collapses if attacked by monsters. So I guess if you don't clear the area properly, then you can lose your camping kit. But um, as long as you're sensible about it, you should be fine. My magic for a disposal. So that's cool. Go on, Colby. Kicking ass and taking names, son. Okay, but it means that if we can find like an, uh, like an even better camping kit, we can swap as well. Like if we find like a lighter camping kit somewhere. That's not a bad idea. Two soaring tails now. Oh, I've been using my cinnamon bark, haven't I? Like a dummy. Like a dummy. Just want to make drafts. Droughts. Droughts. Droughts? I don't remember how you say the word. Drought. 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 It's really going to bug me. People are going to tell me how to say it in the comment section, but it'll be far too late by then. <laughs> Drought. 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 Look, Master, a treasure chest. We shall have to find a way to reach it. They're very helpful. I'll give them that much. I mean, they, they, they nearly get me killed all the time because, hey, look at this cool thing. Hey, look at this cool thing. Like, don't you want to go explore? Don't you want to go deal with all the monsters? Like, you know, sometimes I just want to carry on with my life, you know? I don't know where this chest is. Is it up there? I'm not sure how to get that. Master, if you're carrying around anything you don't need, there's no time like the present to rid yourself of it. Let's see. What can we do? You can count on me to fly to your aid in your hour of need. Oh, I fear. I'm not, have I had a rogue? I think we had a rogue at the very start, didn't we? Like, our, our, one of our first companions was a rogue. I don't think we've had one since then. And here I was hoping for some great treasure. Oh, now I feel a fool. It will find a use for it, I'm sure. I don't know what it is yet, guys. It's a mincemeat rubber runt. Yeah, it's nothing special. Okay, but still. I mean, I do like the idea. Like the game is so freeform when it comes to the like. If I want to change class entirely. And play something else. I can't. If I decide I'm not in the mood for warrior anymore and I want to play an archer, we can do that. You know, it naturally makes sense as well to kind of... I mean, we've seen already, it makes sense to level them all up. And you also want to move your party around with it. You know, there's four classes and four party members. So at least four base types. You've got melee damage. You've got melee tank. You've got range damage. You've got range support. There's always ways to mix and match with those. 
betwixt the classes, but um, and obviously there's more than that in a way. There's more vocations, but those are the general rules in any RPG or MMORPG, etc., etc. Some games have melee supports, but not many. Got them in World of Warcraft, but it took a long time. Not that I play World of Warcraft anymore, but still. Gobbos! <laughs> One singular, utterly annihilated goblin. Oh, sorry, Balf. I'm trying, buddy. I'm trying. It looks like he wants a high five. <laughs> but I don't know what's going on there. We've got to nearly be back at the city, right? I think so. I need to clean my inventory. I'm so tired. Heavy is just not okay. Like, he just, it just doesn't work. I can't sprint at all. I'm gonna try something. You cheeky! <laughs> Well, okay, maybe I don't want to try some. I wanted to try. I've not been using my um, my parry move at all, except that one time we did it. Balthazar? Balthazar, you're on fire. Balthazar. He'll be fine. <laughs> it's, it's fine. It's, it's fine. Everyone's nearly dead, but it's fine. What I can, should it, please you. it does, Guren. It sure does. This is, this is the sea, right? Oh, sweet, sweet freedom, finally. Colby's got like a whole Rambo kind of thing going on. He's got the sleeveless top on. He's got a bow and arrow. He's basically Rambo. <laughs> and he's an official one from Capcom. So for all we know, he was actually... Um, yeah. Like this right here, this looks like, you know, it could be an RPG. Maybe we're playing with three other people. With people's blood, sweat and taxes, no doubt. Yeah, Balthazar, burn it all down, baby. Rage against the machine. Good lad. I wonder where this I'm just curious about the ox cast, where it can take me. I don't really know how it works. I've heard some interesting tidings about town. Right, I'm gonna start talking to random people more. How are things? They're great, Margaret. How are things with you? Good talk, Margaret. I cannot abandon my post. Okay, Simon. It's okay. Say, have I seen you around? Time was. You scarce saw any beastrels here in Vernworth. But that's changed in recent years. I fear I've not useful to share. I'm huge, aren't this I? <laughs> can take us to new heights. After you, Arisen. Hmm. Okay, right. What is this in front of me, by the way? What's this here? Diviner's Salon. What you need of me? No. Okay, I think the first step is just heal up. Well, no, I think the first step is actually equipment, because I can get rid of this nonsense in my inventory. So I need Must we run everywhere? <laughs> you are an impatient one arisen. I'm sorry. Welcome to Bjorn's armor and quality. Yeah, I know, you I know buddy. If you want to survive. Okay, let's get rid of some stuff. What is that? Circle. Oh, it's a helmet thing. Okay, cool. I can give that to um to uh my boy. They're going <sighs> like, if things are really heavy, I kind of just want to get rid of them, you know? The books? I don't care about the books. Never gonna care about the books. Not my wheelhouse. Bunch of flowers. I don't think that's gonna work for this guy, <laughs> but maybe we can find someone who's into flowers. Mm, probably need these. Go put some stuff back in the inventory. 
These are all quite light down here. It's a little heavy. Obviously, I mean, there's plenty of stuff we need to clear. It's not a big deal. You take some stuff off her as well. So before you check the. Should we get anything new by any chance? I don't think so. What did I say I wanted to buy? I could do with buying some gear for Balthazar. Some like, um. robes. Ah, uh, that's a lot of money. Maybe it's just that one. It's a good increase, but it's quite cheap. Yeah, let's get that. Get that for Balfi. Right, just remember, hope to see you again. No, I need to sell it now. Welcome to Hell friend. What you need if you want to survive. And maybe we can enhance. Yeah, it's quite cheap. Enhance Balthazar stuff a little bit. Oh, maybe we can buy him. Oh, I should have looked at buying him a better stuff actually. Now that I think about it. Before you check the price, just... Oh, not, not this guy, the other guy. Many thanks. I appreciate the business. Need to be. Boy's hench. Well, you'd expect a blacksmith to be pretty hench, I suppose. Hello, friend. I've all manner of arms for sale. Come, have yourself a look. Do you sell things for Balthazar? Yeah, okay. Uh... Strength goes up on both. That, that's obviously... Oh, I should buy a shield for myself as well. Um, Price-wise, though, that's still... I mean, that, that doesn't feel like that... Oh, but magic. Yeah. Okay. Go on, then. You lucky duck. And I'm going to try to buy myself a shield. Let's go for the best one for this. Do, 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 do. So I actually have the slate colored horns for that. I don't I'm not gonna worry about that too much though. If I had something that I could upgrade that was something I had. Oh why have I not upgraded those? If it was like a resource I had tons of, I'd be more willing to do it. I need to give this a buff so I'll we'll upgrade them. And then I forgot to do... Okay, bear with me. <laughs> bear with me. So we need to sell that. And I need to equip... I need to sell that. I need to give this to Balthazar. There you go. Tis most I have all manner of arms for... And then we're selling that, right? Okay, it took a little bit of time, but I think we got there. So, come, have yourself. I'm just going to carry around 5,000 rings of cooling at all times. Okay, tavern. Tavern, 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 tavern. It's up here, right? And should my story entertain you? even if it should And then we'll go do some vocation stuff. What are we doing on time? Yeah, we're, we're going to finish off in the town. Well met. You will soon forget the fatigue of a long journey when treated to the. I have no issue falling asleep, even at this time of day. I'm not surprised, Garena. We've been we've been in the wars these last two episodes. Absolute wars. That ogre wrapped me. Our adventure continues. Oh, look at that beautiful. Right, plenty of money, good equipment, full health. Finally, we might need to replace Garena at this point. I think I'm level. What level am I? Like 11, 12, 13? So Grin's five levels down. One thing I should have done, I, I might be... I want to see what the vocation offers, but I'd like to maybe swap to the dual-wielding one. Well met. You are come to... You will soon forget the fatigue of a long journey. Right, let's get rid of some of this nonsense. So I don't need to carry around these. Anything that's about increasing my equipment quality, I want to drop off, basically. And that... Bark, I'm going to do the same because I've seen it pop up as a thing. Fairy stones we should carry around just in case. Someone's at the door, that's very weird.
was Amazon delivering a book? I wish there was a way to do this quicker. <laughs> I guess if it says, if it's got this little, little gem symbol on it, that means it's equipment stuff, right? Actually, can't I just... What's that? Does anyone else have anything? Yeah, I guess that does make it easy. Although not all of them, because like... Mm, I don't care about the branches, actually. Yeah, okay. So it's easy to just go to the materials tab, realistically. Um, I don't know what to do about the Jaspers. Put this away for now. I'm going to keep the tokens. We're going to sell the arrows, probably, and probably the branches as well. Although, I'm going to put the branches away. What we'll do is we'll keep the branches. I'll keep the arrows as well, actually, going forward. Just because then... Um, that's quite heavy as well. Because then, if we decide to, well, when we do, we are going to play an archer at some point. So when we do decide to play an archer, we can, uh, you know where to find. we can, um, we'll have some stuff ready to go. Can I do any combining? I wish there was an easy way to do this. I, I want to well, I wanna manage my inventory. I don't want to listen to this guy prattle on for two whole sentences. I just, I forgot to put the uh, bark away and it's going to annoy me if I carry it around with me. I just saw it a second ago. Don't lie to me, game. I just saw it a second ago. I just saw it a second ago. Didn't I? Was it someone else's? Ah, oh, that's why. Foremost hospitality in all. Okay. Much okay, right. Last thing we're going to do is, uh, well, I need to find... I mean, it says it's here, so who is it here that is the vocation person? Oh, there is a vocation hall. I'm sure I saw that. Listen, I just, I've seen these little daggers on the map, and I'm assuming that's what that's about, but maybe I'm wrong. Let's, let's see if we can find it. Horn Guild. Yeah, Vocation Guild. It's there. <laughs> Do you reckon it's downstairs? Are we on, like, the upper floor, maybe? Uh, yeah. These writings could be of import. Aha! Hurt to take a peek. Hello. Greetings. Welcome to the Guild Hall. Hey, Klaus. Here, we conduct all manner of procedures pertaining to vocations. If there is aught I may assist you with, simply say the word. Have you found any of the items we discussed, per chance? I got a fairy. Okay, so we can see what we get. Ring of Vermints, which sounds pretty great, actually. And that one. Maximum health, maximum stamina, and maximum carry weight. Oh. Daggers with hilts meant to recall snakes on the hunt. They emit a glow whenever treasure is near. Cool. Increases maximum carry weight. Champion's Mantle. Awesome. Gift, charming corset, legion's might, points to equip it, revive of their own accord. Amazing. Oh, that'd be so good for Balthazar, actually, wouldn't it? That'd be amazing for Balthazar. Only 178 to go. And then that one gives me more discipline for defeating foes, which seems a bit pointless, because by the time you get to this point, do you need discipline anymore? But we'll see. Aha! So why can't I... Why can't I acquire that? Because I, I want to swap to... I think I want to swap to warrior rather than fighter. I just think going in with a dual-wielding weapon sounds cool. <laughs> That's really all there is to it. These are very cheap. I'm going to pick up all these. Why can't I swap? Why can't I do this? Look at all the augments as well, like maximum health and stuff like that. Lots of, yeah, it's getting much more expensive. <clears throat> we can buy provocation, increase the likelihood of being targeted. Yeah, I'm just sorry, why can't I? Do I need to... Don't know. <laughs> Wait, I want to find, I want to find, this is going to really annoy me. I want to find out. Um, 
Uh, dragons, dogma, two, warrior, and sorcerer. Red. I don't know. Oh, right. Okay. Um... Right, let's let's get let's get some stuff here. So we've got blink strike. We can. Okay, it's like a better version. But I I want to pick something new. Duck backward before charging in to deliver a slashing blow. Use an evasive mana. Okay, so dodging with it makes it do more damage. <gasps> okay, that's awesome. I want people to do that to me though. I don't want to be the one. Some interesting stuff. I definitely want to. I just want to pick up one new ability, I think. Thrust the blade into the target's body before raining further blows upon them. If strikes connect, the user clings to larger targets. So that's. Yeah, that seems really good against. Um, against high up targets. And that's good AoE, so let's grab that as well. Okay, we'll stick with those for now. Um, core skills. Use a shield to ease the impact of falling. <gasps> yes! <laughs> I'm all over that one. <laughs> We're using defend while enchanted. Automatically counters with an elemental attack. Yeah, let's do that as well, because we, we do that quite a lot. And then I'm gonna I'm gonna hold off because that's a lot of money. Uh Balthazar. So he's a mage at the moment. I think I kinda want him to stay as a mage rather than a sorcerer, right? Because that's gonna do more damage. Let me see if what he's got skills though. We can get a more powerful flame jet. Um, if I get all the... Oh, what's this do? Oh, it's just longer lasting. That's not exciting. Hastens the speed of allies. Cures a caster of debilitations. That sounds really useful. Full heal. I don't I kind of prefer the AoE heal that we keep... Like, it must be a core skill or something, because he keeps doing it. <laughs> he can float? <laughs> um, augments. Increase the amount of health recovered by curatives. Yeah, let's grab that. Beatitude. And... I'm going to increase his flagra flagration. Make that stronger. So we've got lightning, fire, I want to get something else. Uh, we, we need an ice attack, maybe we'll get Frigor. Did that do damage? Oh, I think so. I also want to get like the ice... The problem is he can only have four at a time. And I kind of just want to give him like all the boons to make me stronger. But I also, I kind of want him to be doing his own thing as well, you know? We can get one more. That's a holy attack. Oh, good at night time. Sure. Forgive me, but I'm afraid we are not accepting registration for warriors or sorcerers at this time. You see, as we currently have no archer staves or great swords on hand, we are unable to outfit new members, and we cannot simply purchase more, as the delivery of arms intended for the local armory and other guilds in this domain was plundered by goblins. So regrettably, I cannot assist you, unless you were to procure a weapon yourself, that is. Let me see. What else can I tell you of our guild? Right, so that is how we're going to unlock them. Certain vocations are unavailable at present. Save to applicants who already possess the requisite equipment. Let me see. What else okay. can I do? Roderick will be able to tell you aught of the stolen shipment. Aught he might, Klaus. Aught he, he might. The local armory, and we purchase almost all of our stock from him. May fortune smile upon you, sir. And you, sir. We'll not find anything if we don't start looking. Okay, that's cool. Now, we need to, before we go, we need to nip back to the inn because as you'll have just seen, when we unlock a vocation, we um, we pick up the... It's this way, isn't it? 
when we pick up a vocation, we also pick up the equipment from that vocation. So I just got this huge array of equipment. I mean, can I just sell it? Because, I mean, I'll just buy, I'm going to get better ones, surely. Right? I'd, just, I'd be able to buy better ones when the time... Yeah, I'm going to sell all of it, basically. We'll just buy better ones when the time calls for it. So I'm going to go talk to the... Your hair is wild. Hundred? Alright, you better make this worth it. Much appreciated. Okay, I'm not, not sure what. <laughs> anyway, can I want my money back? Oi, friend. Klaus sent word that you've agreed to rescue some of my pilfered equipment. I'd be grateful for aught you can reclaim, truly. Fair warning. Goblins are behind these ox cart raids, I've since learned. No doubt they're hoarding the stolen arms in their den from the tell of it. Their lair lies somewhere along the western road. Pray do be careful. If all were to go awry, it would weigh heavily on my heart. Losing my wares for good would make me sore. But no sack of gold could compare to a fellow life, eh? He's a good egg, isn't he? Buy my rubbish, Roderick. Buy my rubbish. Yes, yeah, it's, it's, it's all cheap stuff. We don't need it. What we do need is money, so... We are so close to lightweight again. Why does this weight sound so goddamn heavy? Hey, we made it. <laughs> what? I don't even know what's weighing me down. I think it's just my equipment. Okay, so. So. So, 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 so. That over there is... Well, let's have a look here. Scaly Invaders, that's, uh, yeah, we're not worried about that, that's that, where's this one? Right, is that, that's really close to the town though, so let's, uh, okay, eh. let's go do that first, we'll hop out to the west next video, we're gonna get an arch staff and a great sword, that means that I can become a warrior if we decide to go in that direction and Balthazar could in theory become a sorcerer or whatever the heck the other one is um, which is pretty fun I think and yeah so next video we'll uh, I, you know I might not even do it because then I wouldn't have a tank but I do tend to not prefer I tend to not play with a sword and shield I tend to play with a double handed weapon or indeed dual wield We'll see what happens. Either way, thank you very much for joining me. I'll see you lovely folks very soon. Cheers much love as always. Bye-bye.